Paul, I'm a business entrepreneur first. Uh, I've been in Qatar for the past 20 years, and I've been very interested in the business environment. I've been working in different, uh, different fields and sectors from hospitality, F&B, uh, civil works, construction, uh, pretty much airline, pretty much everywhere. Uh, I've always been interested in business itself, and uh, I've been working for a lot of local companies in the past 20 years. Uh, I've learned a lot, a great deal from them. There were some great people, some great um, uh, local partners that we worked with. So I've always been interested in this, and I decided to pursue this at a higher level. Uh, I decided to go more into advising other business entrepreneurs and advising companies on how to set up their own companies. Well, uh, I was actually working in one of the local companies here, Arafat Business Center, and I was the general manager there. And we were dealing with a lot of local companies uh, that wanted, and business entrepreneurs, local entrepreneurs, that they wanted to open a business in Qatar. So <clears throat> dealing with them every day, we got to see their struggles. So we've identified that it, within the fr a very short period of time from the time they opened their business, we've identified that they have a lot of struggles and obstacles that they are not able to, uh, how can I say, to address properly. So we've identified that there is a gap there, there is a necessity, there is a need for our service. So there is a need for advisory services for entrepreneurs and for business people who want to have an idea and they want to turn it into a successful company. There is a need for advice on that. So we decided to open a company. We said we're going to open a business consultancy company. Like I said, we, we've opened the company because we've identified this need in the market. So we said this is our niche, this is where we can help the local companies, this is where we can help the local people on how to build their businesses. So there were three partners, we are three partners actually who started the business, each of us is in a different field. So I'm into business management and uh, my qualifications and my MBA is into business management. And then I have another partner who is in IT and he's the backbone of our business. And there is another one who is more into the training part. So we decided that all of us, we can make the great team and we can actually bring a lot of value to the market. So we just came up with the idea and we said, let's just open a business management consultancy. So what we do actually as part of our services, so we help companies and business entrepreneurs, we help them establish their, uh, turn their business idea into a successful business every step of the way. So uh, Winston Churchill is the one who said that failure to plan is planning to fail, correct? So what we've noticed is that most of the companies here and the business entrepreneurs, they have the idea, but they're struggling to plan for it. So having a proper business plan, having a sales plan, having a marketing plan, having an operational plan, these are all very important steps that a business has to take in order to become successful, correct? Yeah. So this is where we come in, and this is what, what we want to do for companies, and this is what we do. Yeah. Where what makes us special is actually consistency and technology. Yeah. So we use these two items. We are very consistent in our work and um, we use technology to discover new ways and uh, of, uh, how can I say, new ways of developing best practices for companies so they don't have to struggle. So technology is a big part of what we have. Plus, we have something, our competitive advantage, let's see, another one is the services that we provide. We provide everything. When I say A to Z, it's A to Z. So we come with you not only in theory, so let's say we don't just give you a business plan, we stay with you, we show you how to implement the business plan, we train you and we train the people, your staff, your employees, we make sure that your success is our success. So we actually stay with you throughout the entire journey of your business, uh, business path. So we are there with you. We don't just do theory, we do practice.
So in the next few years, like I said, we really want to help and we want to develop programs where we can assist more the entrepreneurs in Qatar and we can assist more the SMEs into their, uh, into their struggle. So there are a lot of obstacles nowadays, correct, with economy worldwide. We're not talking Qatar is the best be so far, right? Qatar still has a good economy and it's a very good environment for SMEs and entrepreneurs. There are a lot of programs that Qatar has developed to support. QDB has a very good uh, program for business entrepreneurs, for startups. There are innovation programs that are being developed. So we want to support more in that. So we want to work with ministry and we want to work with various organizations in the future that will allow us to support more and to develop this type of, pro uh, this type of programs. Yes. For sure, and uh, we hope that we see you shall, in our opportunity and uh, uh, other interview and better position with you in the international market as well. Inshallah. <laughs> We're going regional after yeah. this. <laughs> We're currently local, but our plan is to go on the region and potentially international. Yeah. like to say a big thank you from our side because without them and without Qatar and without the opportunities that we were given here we wouldn't be able to grow. I have been here for 20 years working so I was an employee before I was a, a business owner and uh, it is a big thing that somebody like me can grow like that and I think a lot of people have grown like that because Qatar has offered us the opportunity to do that. And Qatar has developed so much in the past 20 years. You know, we were going from where we were writing everything down, you know, we were, we were having papers everywhere, going to online platforms now, everything is done digital. There is so much development and so much expansion and so much effort put in from the government. So we as business owners, we definitely appreciate that because it has made our life easier. So. Yeah. Well, I think all the people that I've met, and especially the local people, the local Qatari people, I have worked a lot with the business owners, and we've learned so much from them, you know. They have so much history when it comes to business. They have so much common sense, and they know what they're doing. And <clears throat> uh, they've been so supportive of us. And of course, my partners. Without them, I have Leah and Hamza. They are, you know, the best people in the world to work with. And without, we are like, uh, you know, the perfect team to work with. So. Yeah, Without them, I, we would not be here, obviously. Yeah. <laughs>